Alright guys, in today's gaming news video, we have the unfortunate cancellation of an amazing looking Viking project that a lot of people were waiting for. Also the official Xbox Digital event announced with plenty of upcoming games to be shown that I'll be talking about in this video and the PlayStation 5 Digital Conference coming sooner than expected. Let's get right into it. It is a pretty massive day for gaming news in general and especially fans of the Viking setting. For one, we had Assassin's Creed Valhalla which was officially revealed and looks super promising. And now we have the cancellation of a long awaited Viking project of mine. I was so excited for this. Announced in 2016 first as Project White, Darkborn is a game in which players control a monster whose species has been hunted to near extinction by humans. Darkborn tells the story of a young monster's quest for survival in a hostile world, following its oddly adorable protagonist as it grows and develops into a worthy beast, a killing machine that wants to destroy the invaders, which are the Vikings. This game included something unique because you played as the enemy, well the enemy to the humans, you're the monster. Today the Swedish game studio called The Outsiders announced development on Darkborn has been cancelled indefinitely. They might return to it one day, but don't expect it to be anytime soon. The development studio announced the unfortunate news this morning via Twitter. The Outsiders is now working on something else, though what that is remains to be seen for now. Hopefully some of Darkborn makes its way over to the new project, because it had a lot going for it in my opinion. Let me know if you guys were waiting for this game or if you didn't know about it, but now really wanted to try it out. Darkborn shouldn't be in your list of upcoming games anymore. Next up we have the official Xbox Digital Conference being announced and is coming on May 7th at 8am pacific time. Finally, Microsoft was the first company to reveal its next generation console and now it seems it will be the first to reveal its next generation games. Microsoft has confirmed that fans will get their first look at Xbox Series X game during a special Inside Xbox presentation that will air next week. Microsoft stopped short of confirming which games it will be showing at the event, but Ubisoft did respond to the announcement tweet with a tease that it will be there, with an official gameplay trailer of Assassin's Creed Valhalla, but not just that. This could definitely mean we will see our first look at other Ubisoft games, like Rainbow Six Quarantine, Gods and Monster, and one of my most awaited, Far Cry 6. Far Cry 6 has been leaked by the most renowned leaker to be in development and releasing before March 2021, so you can expect it to be announced really really soon. Its setting has also been rumored to be either North Korea, Modern Day Dinosaur, Alaska or Cuba. Something to note from this upcoming event is the gameplay presentation will focus mostly on games from partners and not the main Xbox Game Studios title, like Fable 4, Halo Infinite and such. The event focused on the Xbox exclusives will come at a later date, which we don't know for now but is said to be either in June or July. Though we could definitely see an announcement cinematic trailer or teaser trailer of Xbox exclusives of some sort at the event next week, then the gameplay reveal to come at the next event. Now let's get into the third party games we could definitely see next week at this Xbox event. First off is the long awaited reveal of the Batman game reboot. Warner Bros Montreal has been highly teasing it over the past several months, and it was also confirmed the game would have been shown at E3, E3 now cancelled. Next week on May 7 could be when we will see our first look, as well as other Warner Bros projects, including the reveal of Rocksteady's new game and the leaked Harry Potter open world RPG. It's very highly and almost confirmed developers, Avalanche Software, have recently been hiring for a soon to be announced game. This Harry Potter game in which the leaks are 100% legit, players will be able to explore a massive open world including Hogwarts, make friends good or bad, have your own house, customize your character and magic abilities and choose to be good or evil. Next week could definitely be its reveal, but if it is not, 
Warner Bros. were looking to host a digital conference of its own happening in May, so it's still very close. What we could also see next week is the Elden Ring by From Software creators of Dark Souls and Bloodborne, and also George R. R. Martin, creator of Game of Thrones. Elden Ring was announced at E3 2019 with a short trailer and nothing else since. Since E3 2020 is cancelled, we could definitely see it next week at the event, with a gameplay trailer if possible. The third and final Hitman has also been highly rumored to be revealed soon, as well as Resident Evil 8. Resident Evil 8 has leaked a couple of weeks ago and detailed a castle siege with armored zombies, a first person view, different kind of strange monsters, and a witch that follows you around, and she also laughs. There's so many games we can expect to see including a gameplay teaser for both Halo Infinite and the next Fable game, but I want you guys to comment what you would like to see or what you're expecting to see next week, let me know. That's not all of course, the most renowned leaker on the internet also said the PlayStation 5 digital event is coming in a few more weeks, hinting at maybe the end of May or in June. What we could see there or next week from Xbox is up to our imagination but there is a lot, including Bethesda's next big game, Starfield, Wild, a project from Rockstar Games and more. It seems that Xbox has a big summer planned in any case, and with this event only beginning to show what they have lined up for the Series X at launch, it's clear that Microsoft is pulling up all the stops to ensure it's a major player in the years to come. Until then, fans should keep their eyes on May 7th inside Xbox, where it seems they'll finally get to see what all the next generation fuzz is about. I will be covering every single news coming out of this event and any other console event, so make sure you also keep an eye out on this channel. I'm really hoping that both consoles will deliver something amazing, but I feel like Xbox might have a little bit of a head start right now, which is the first time in many many years. Let me know in the comments which game are you most excited to see revealed. Myself is the Harry Potter open world. Alright guys, make sure you support this video by liking it for more gaming news on upcoming games and of course subscribe. Thanks to Jigglyboy and I am Legend for being a master member on the channel. You can become a survivor member for 99 cents only. It'll help me and the channel as a whole. Thanks for watching.